Welcome everyone, this is your host Scott Ioka, and welcome back to Final Fantasy XV. I'm seeing enemies. Ah, there we go. Oh god, for one, this... Hey, hey, did I say you can dodge shit? There we go. Ow, 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 ow. There we go. Trying to get rid of all these enemies. Oh my god, there's so many enemies right here. It's ridiculous right now. Hey, Bronco. Now keep your feet steady. Gotcha. Hands down. Gotcha. Oh, God. Hands down. Oh. Took it out. Gotcha. Did you learn that one, not? God, there's so many of them. Oh, got a heal Ignis. No, 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 no. Shit. Where's Ignis at? Okay, item, potion, heal me. Thank God. Trying to take out any animal or creature that may be in a distance. There we go, like that. Something that can sneak up. Should prompt us in trouble. Sit this one out, champ. Come on, you can do it. There we go. These blue creatures, though. That thing. Um, what? Try this again, minus a sucking, preferably. Come on, do it! Ah, oh, damn, I missed. For some reason, Noctis is not like uh, targeting the blue ones, even though the blue ones are kind of what we need to get rid of right now. There we go. Get rid of the blue ones. We pretty much get pretty much get rid of that herd, I think. There we go. Oh, goddamn, goddamn time. Glad to put that behind us. <sighs> All right, what am I expecting now?
Okay, stomping ground is just around the corner. I am a little nervous about this right now. Exercise due caution. I don't like that sound. Oh, there it is. Not yet. We have to devise a plan after we follow it home. So we gotta follow the damn thing and try to take it out then. Follow the die dead eye back to its lair. Do not let it see you. Do not lose its trail. Step back or take cover behind the rocks. I'm trying to. There we go. There we go, there we go, there we go. Oh my god. That thing is huge. Tread lightly. There we go, okay. Behind this rock. It's not gonna see me. Do not see me. If you see me now, I'll be very upset that I... Oh my god, this is creepy! Oh, man. Lose dead eye, okay. Okay, dead eye's over there. Nope, I'm not letting this damn thing see me. Really, you're circling back around? Try not to get too close to it, because if I get too close, I screw myself over. There's some rocks right here. Good! Good rocks! I like rocks right now. Rocks are my friend. Rocks are very... Good friend. Come on. You can do this. Right there. Ooh, what's this? What can you pick up? Tiny feather, okay. Uh, what? You have discovered Dead Eye's lair. Sneak through the stones into the ruins. Over there so quickly. The day's work. This is a checkpoint. You will return here if you are defeated. Resting or exiting the game deletes checkpoints. Oh. So we better not exit the game then, because otherwise that'd be kind of bad. 
Aha! We are here! This way! There it is! Each of us will need to do his part if we're going to succeed. Learning the behemoth here falls to you, Highness. I'm loath to put you in such far, far, harm's way. Fun. Let me walk through the plan. Okay. So what's the plan, Ignis? Stick with Ignis as he lays out the plan. Prompto. Yeah? Plan. Prompto will fire on the gas tank that set it a blast. Yes, sir. <coughs> Gladio. Huh. Plan. The Gladio will lay and wait and attack from Dead Eye's blind spot. Gotcha. Enemy. Highness. Focus. Aha! Uh. Uh -huh. You will wake Deadeye, warp back to us with the beat and peace and toe, and amid the chaos of the blast, land the finishing blow. Yeah. By all means. Run away! No time to dilly dally. No, 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 no. Come on, come on, warp, warp! 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 It's time. I got it! Oh! Oh, yes! What a behemoth! Oh, making my bitch. Yeah. Oh yeah. Woo. What? Up? We got some real chemistry here. That's what I call teamwork. Impeccable. <laughs> We're awesome. That's why. Oh fuck. No 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 no. Uh, Ow. Run! Please let me run. Then I cannot see out of his right eye. Use his blind spot to your advantage. Size of him. I didn't know they made him that big. So, how do we take him on? Carefully. One mistake could be our last. Two. 
Come on, potion me, thank you. Enough of this. Time to cut and run. Damn it. Fucking stasis. I'm trying to catch up as quick as I can right now, but it's a little too scary! Oh god. That was hard. It's hard to get past him. Last checkpoint, because I was right there, so. I think I'm gonna have to just avoid Deadeye mostly altogether. I think that's probably gonna have to be the plan. If I can avoid him altogether, I have a chance to live. Ah, okay. So let's try this again, minus the sucking. All in a day's work. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna go back. So we gotta get to the plant part again. God damn, that thing is just so big and frightening. Okay. Let me walk you through the plan. So I'm not entirely sure if it's on purpose that they actually put uh, subtitles right there, or text, uh, or if it's not completed yet yeah. with the uh, dubbing. Yes, sir. Gladio. Huh. And then my part last. Focus. Uh. All right. By all means. <laughs> now I'm running a little bitch again. I don't want. To, uh, 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 there we go. I did. That's why I didn't ask for time because I was still locked on. Come on, over there! Thank God. It's time. Again. Going for it. Boom, bitches. Some real chemistry here. That's what I call teamwork. Impeccable. <laughs> All right. Now for the real test of this fight. Your Highness! Ow. Again with the owl. Dealing down the shivvy shadow. Get ready for the big one! Oh, 
Ow. There we go. Try to get myself healed back up here for a second. Come on. Can't see me. Can't see me. Oh, screw it. I'll do the gates. Too close for comfort. Yes. Oh my god. We'll make camp nearby. I know the beast won't dare to follow. Alright. Okay, so it's already marked. Good. Oh my god. At least now I can actually cut through and it'll be a lot faster now. But my god, that fight was freaking scary! Freaking scary, man! There's our campsite right there. So we'll actually camp right there. Now usually I actually, um make them eat and sleep but I kind of wonder what happens if I spar again so I'm gonna try the sparring and see how well that goes can't take a behemoth in that okay I don't think gargantuan predators are have a thingy thing blah 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 better the gloves speak to the stable master at the chocobo post So we'll actually spar with Gladio. Let's see what happens. I'm going all out. Just don't get too carried away. Show on the talk. Ow. <laughs> yes, I like a rematch. I'm going all out. Just don't get too carried away. Show one to talk. Gotcha. Oh. Come on, that's not the prince I know. <sighs> it wasn't my style. One more rematch, just to see if I can actually beat him. I'm going all out. Just don't get too carried away. Show one to talk. Bam! Wow, he still beat me. No. Well, I know I can't beat him, but it was fun. It's fun. Yeah. Um. Okay, let's. Time. Yeah. Even though we call it an early day technically, but I wanted to uh, get their stuff back up. I 
I really like how you gotta camp out and, because it actually allows it allows people like me who grind to still get the challenge of grinding. Awesome. All right. So now we're gonna go to that town. It's time. Oh, yep. Right. So where is our destination again? There it is, over there. You actually take falling damage. Holy crap! Wow, this is gonna be a pretty long walk again too. I think that's the one thing that I'm almost turned off about the game is that there's all it's the world's really huge, but at the same time I'm so intrigued by it because there's so much to see, and it's actually pretty easy to know where you have to go. Let's see if we can cut through these rocks. If not, then we'll just have to go around. But okay, time to go again. Nope. Ah, uh, no, fuck that shit. I'm not staying. That was a little too scary for my taste, if I do say so myself. <coughs> so we have to go all the way around, but that's no problem. Dooby doop doop, going all the way around. Because that's what we do best. And probably gonna fight some monsters along the way. And kill all the monsters, because we are badass like that. We are badass like that. We are badass like that. Because we are Noctis and badass. I do like Noctis as a character so far. Because he actually stands out from a lot of other protagonists who are... Um, say like Lightning or... Um... Whew. Lightning or Cloud or Squall. Yeah, we could cover quicker with some chocobos. It would sure beat the hell out of walking. Because first off, I think he's one of the only male protagonists that has black hair. Stay sharp. Bring it on. Kill these guys off pretty quick. Oh, there's more. That it? Yeah, cool, that's it. Take down. Surprised we're still standing. Ah, these guys are not a problem That's at all. all but yeah, so far, um, I really like this demo. I mean, we have a couple technical problems I'm hoping they will fix. But considering, you know, that the world is huge, I can imagine them having a couple of hiccups here and there. I'm hoping the hiccups probably go away by the time the game's fully released. Exactly. Nope. Oh, really? Really? Now I can contend with them. Alright, what else do we have? Or that it? Cool, that's it. That's all she wrote. Oh, 
thought we got a pretty good experience. Alright, we're 200, less than 260 meters away from our destination, which is good, because I don't know where we're going. I think it's going to be that little chokeable area where we went to before, in the previous episode at least, so... Alright, we're getting slightly closer. There's a lot of walking, that's for sure. I cannot wait until the game fully released and I can take my damn car. At least then the car's a lot faster. I think that was one of the other main problems I had with Final Fantasy XII, was that the world was so expansive that it was hard to keep up with everything because there was no vehicle. It took so long to get from place to place. Yep, I was right, it was a chokeable place. Uh, let's see what the locals have to say about uh, Dead Eye. Hi, it's us again. We couldn't stay away another day. You have any birds in need of a bite? Sure do. They've all been waiting for you to come out again. Thanks for keeping them hungry for us. Be right back. Excuse me. Again, we couldn't stay away another day. You have any birds in need of a bite? Sure do. They've all been waiting for you to come out again. Thanks for keeping them hungry for us. Let's just look at this NPCs real quick. Let's take a good look of how these NPCs look. That's a that's a pretty good detail for just NPCs by themselves. There are a lot to take you on these parts. Or Something like that. Clear that cave nearby if you know what's good for you. Wouldn't want that to be the last sight you see. Destination updated. <laughs> All right, so where is it? I mean, there it is. So we gotta go to the cave, probably, and I believe this cave actually has a bunch of goblins. So we're going to kind of old school Final Fantasy with some of these monsters. So That's old school it. that they didn't. Pronto. Be right there. So old school that really I have never seen some of these monsters. <coughs> Ooh, what's this? Tiny feather. A fantasy based on reality. And they were not kidding on that uh, on that promise. I'm very interested to see where we're gonna go next with this. We, look, we do have quite a bit of a, uh, we have a little bit left of uh, distance, so, I mean, yeah, there's a lot of walking around this demo, but, um, oh, uh -oh. got some battles. Don't even think about running away. I don't even think about it. I really like how it's kind of a hack and slash in this game. But it still has kind of the uh, vibe of Final Fantasy. Less than one minute it took to beat them. Nice to see, no damage. Not bad experience. Hoping for a little bit more, but oh well. 
The good thing about the experience here is that until you camp, your experience just I'm going all out. Just don't get too your experience is uh just yeah. keeps going. Uh, no, you're not running away. There we go. Eh, you know, no big deal at all. We just kicked their ass like it was nothing. I mean, but, like, it kind of reminds me of Final Kingdom of Hearts as well for uh, some of the controls. What else? Oh shit, a shit ton of these blue ones, okay. BAM! One down. I didn't parry in time. Just wail on them and you're good to go. Because they're a small enough monster, at least like my normal strikes, can actually make them flinch. Boom! A lot of these, that's for sure. But they give out good experience, a hundred apiece. Plus, if we uh, defeat them fast enough, we probably get like a bonus, which is always nice to do. There we go. I got 121 experience boost. Cool. Damn! 1500! That's not bad at all, if I do say so myself. But be, be, but the cool thing is, is because of the amount of experience, you can actually... This goes. Uh, in a cave. Looks a little sketchy to me. Looks a lot of sketchy to me. Bad idea. Cool. Checkpoint. Let's head in. Trying. We're drifting into the deep end. Yeah, what's that worst? I can have them prompto. The interesting thing too about their names, I've noticed, is that they're very Latin. -like. Hi, bats. What's not expecting you? Come I always end up in these situations? Oh, look at the bright side. Everybody, stay alert. Get nothing over here. Hey, knock. Check this out. Oh. Hey, knock. Check this out. What? What did you see? Oh, was it just the rest of the bit you were looking at? Ah, I already got it. I already got it, Gladius. Oh, there's another one. Shattered timepiece. I don't know what that is, but it was interesting sounding. Possible enough. So, Lulu, how do you like the uh, the game so far? The way it looks and everything. Tight squeeze. Slightly. Might just make it through. Might. Come on. Yeah, Noctis doesn't seem like a problem. He's like just. Prompto, prop, prompto, calm down, prompto. You do not need to hyperventilate here, man. Kind of need your head in the game. I don't want to die again. Do not need a second game over. Quiet now. What? Wait. I'll shut up. What? I didn't need to see that. 
focus. Oh shit. Oh my god, this is so cool. Yeah, 211. What up? Can be, uh, yeah, I can see their breath, so I guess it, it is a bit chilly. Good. Crawl through. Don't lose your head. Really, please, just just don't lose your head. Gotcha! So beautiful. Oh, the kills and the attacks are just so beautiful to look at. Still pretty damn good experience if I do say so myself. Alright, looks like we've got it to go over here now. It never ends. Oh Prompto, look at the bright side of things. At least you have a flashlight. <laughs> if you were walking here with a alone in the cave. Uh, and, oh shit! You took me by surprise there! You little goblin thing, you. I don't to go, cool. That's awesome. 258. Not bad. Okay, I need you guys to move, please. Thank you. Couldn't move for a minute. I was getting a little nervous. So I was like, please, game, don't glitch on me. I'm a bad fe I, I have bad feelings when it comes to glitches in games. Okay, not them, it's just something I can pick up off the ground. Oh shit, it is them! Let's go. I was not expecting that! What can I say? Oh god, that scared me a little bit. It made me jump. I, I will admit that. Game. It's game. Boom! Gotcha. Oh shit, that was the wrong guy. Boom! So what exactly are we doing in here anyways? Because we don't... I don't know exactly what I'm in here for. I know it's a possibility of actually getting something to defeat the uh, behemoth, but I don't know what it is exactly that I'm looking for. Yeah. 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 
out behind. That is crossing the line. My hand slipped. Back at it. Gotcha. Hey, where'd you learn that one, Knock? I've always known it because I'm a badass. Okay. Thank you, Ignis. Be on my way, please. Put it in the books. Alright, so we gotta go Your this Highness. way. Admit it. We're lost. We're not lost. We just took a detour. That's all. Don't worry. When have I ever let you down, Prompto? Except for that one time you wanted me to ask that girl out for you. And when I did ask that girl out for you, she thought I was talking about. Oh no 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 Thankfully, they were all bunched up together, so it was actually really easy to just take them all out once. God, I'm surrounded. We are surrounded. I hope I can make it out of this fight alive. So many coming at me at once, it's pure insanity. I've never seen as many enemies on screen before in this game. At least from the first uh, playthrough. First, uh, not playthrough, but first, uh, uh, first uh, live stream of it. Okay. Oh damn, finally. Glad to put that behind us. You say that again, Jesus Christ. Yeah. Are you enjoying the live stream, Lulu? Well, hello there, sword. Ancient blade. Armager can be activated in combat using with a full MP attributes. Okay, so. I will go on ahead. Inventory. Is it inventory? No, it's uh, pad. There we go. Weapons. Huh. Slow down a sec. What was that? What was that noise? Yeah. Bob, are you okay? Hey, I can't hear you. This way. Uh oh. Uh oh. Did we get separated? I don't like being separated. Uh oh. Uh oh. No, 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 no. 
Are you okay? Hey, I can't hear you. That's it. I quit. What the hell are we doing here? Snakes. Why did it have to be snakes? Hey! They tried to attack you! Yeah, I'm just trying to take these guys out now before we get too surrounded again. Perry's gonna be my best friend with this fight. I cannot wait to see what kind of experience I'm going to be getting from the level up. I didn't think I would see you from back there, but I did. With the power of warp, I can get to anywhere and defeat anything. Except for Behemoth, apparently. Oh, fuck. My god, this is just, it's, these fights are hard, but it's fun. Well, put it in the books. I will say that, the fights are hard, but they're fun. Come on, gotta keep moving. So which way are we going? This way? I hope I got a Shattered Timepiece, so that also works. There's light, thankfully. Okay. So apparently we're going this way, so downward. Fuck! Let's clean them up quick. Just kicking ass and taking names because that's what I do. You guys can take care of the other one, right? Okay. Oh yeah, we're we got some pretty damn good experience from these fights, that's for sure. Um, okay, I'm thinking we gotta go. Ignis, be on my way, please. Thank you. Let's 
trying to figure out a good place where it's supposed to be going. Maybe this way? I think, yeah, we're supposed to be going this way. Oh no, I'm turning around. I'm turning around. Oops. My bad, I, I went the wrong way. Okay, so we gotta go this way now, I believe. I hope. Don't wanna be turned around again. It's like right there too. I wanna know what it is so badly. I'm going the right way? Nope, I went the wrong way again. So note to self when playing the real the full game, stay or always check the map. Just keep checking the map because you can get turned around easily in this game. Right. Aha. What? Aha. Well, well. I was asking that same thing question. Okay, Mr. Let's see. Now what? Ooh, assimilating a new astral power. Rama will bestow his grace on Noctis when Noctis' HP is zero. Common enemies defeated by Rama do not provide ex items or experience in the episode Death Sky. Okay. Yes. So we're leaving the cavern now. I think we're near the end of the uh, demo so before I yes so I think what I will do is once um, this is okay <sighs> actually even though we, we we're told to go over there I think first I am going to save. Like, I'm actually not going to just save, but... but I'm going to camp out, is what I should be saying. Where's the camping spot at? Okay, set destination. through them. All right. Bring it on, bitches. I am not in wildlife. Simple. I owe you one. Stay alive. Never miss. All right. I'm not going to worry about summoning Rama right now cuz I want to save Rama. And boom! Uh, 
Damn, this fight's hard. Trying to kick out at least one or two of these enemies to some experience out of it. Choice. Hi, Rama. Nice seeing you here again. I'm so speechless right now. That made me speechless. I'm just so amazed at how the graphics are for this game. Oh my god. I'm having a fangasm right now. <laughs> Ow. Now maybe that's a little too high of a jump. <clears throat> Sounds good. After this, we're going to take on the behemoth, and then that'll be the end of the demo. Past 21. Uh, past 20, actually, that's what I wanted to have. Okay, saving game. Cool. Alright. Let's roll. So, set destination. Let's do it. The only way to actually take out Behemoth is going to be with Rama. That's going to be the only way to do it. So I hope you're excited because I'm excited to see how this demo is going to end out. Because I think the Behemoth, not Behemoth, Behemoth fight is going to probably be the end of it. But I'm so excited to see how this demo ends. Okay. I'm getting there, I'm less than 400 meters away now from my destination. Dealing more, a lot more damage to these enemies now, which is good. Okay, 
Okay. Yeah, they were a lot easier just from this fight alone. <coughs> and that's why I like going to five levels after in between boss fights because <coughs> you are in my way, monster. Nothing to it. Because we're awesome. Now, it's all about also trying to remember where we need to go to get to our location. Because really, I am terrible at trying to figure out where I have to go, and that's why I think this demo takes longer than it should. Because I'm so terrible at finding where I need to go. Oh, there we go. I think we're getting there now. Yep. Alright, this is it. This is the fight. The big one. Where's it at? Oh shit, you're right there. Finish the job. Oh, oh my God, it's so amazing! Thanks, Rama. Yeah. Take down. Yeah. This is it. The Surprise ticket to getting our car back. Yep. Feeling pretty proud right about now. I think I'm having a moment. Yeah, we'd uh better hurry over to Cindy's. Good idea. Yes, I'm gonna save. Before we might reclaim our car, we'll need to claim the small fortune this behemoth horn should fetch. So the behemoth thorn horn at a shop, okay. So I guess we already have the behemoth horn. Because it's not letting me pick up anything from that, so. So, what do I get from this? Well... Our main character is different from Cloud and Squall and Lightning, in a good way, thankfully. Because they're the brooding characters, and he's a little more lighthearted, despite the voice actor sounding very dark with his voice. But you know what? Um, I think uh, I like the fact that the character is a little more lighthearted in his nature. He is one of the very few dark hair protagonists in Final Fantasy. Most protagonists have uh, brunette or blonde hair, if you notice. So, it's kind of nice seeing a different character that's uh, different. In fact, in a way, I guess you could say he is the original Cloud. Or, or yeah, Noctis is kind of the original incarnation of Cloud, of what Cloud was supposed to kind of look like. Because, 
this game this is a game that I believe um that was, they wanted to make back in Final Fantasy 7 but couldn't because of the limitations of the technology and now with the PlayStation 4 they're not bound by those limitations anymore so right now we are about 300 meters away I'm not gonna worry about the fight Right now, I'm going all out. Just don't get too carried away. Ha! Showing the time. Okay, maybe I will. No, they they annoy me. Just take this thing out if I can. This thing's huge. I'm going to just abuse the summon ability in this. I'm going to abuse it. I'm kind of scared to know what's going to happen. I gotta figure out where the hell I'm supposed to be going because I kinda am lost right now. I think it's this way. Yep, that was right. The gas station <coughs> the same wherever you go. That one looks more like the gas station the time for God. Look a tad out of place in the Crown City. Gotta love that smell though, right? Easy as they come. Miss bitch. I think another thing I really like about this is the fact that you can hold multiple weapons at multiple times, which is kind of cool. All right, so we're back at the gas station again for like the third. Oh no, this is a different place. Okay. <clears throat> Knocked. Time to trade that behemoth sword for a behemoth cash. Yes, it is time to do that. Knock, knock, Sydney. Guess who's here? Or maybe Sydney's not here. Damn. Savior Garula, ceremonies grilled at perfection. Okay. Hey there. Hi. Um, we're here to uh, sell stuff. Uh, where is it? Ah, this. I know, me too. Pass the time with all that money. No time for that. All right. So, where do we go next? Wait, we're in here. Sydney's here. Now that I think about it, let's just take a look, take a look at the cars. A lot of um, old cars, actually. Despite this being like, and looks like like kind of a modern day ish setting, possibly there's a lot of old cars that you see, like a, say a car show, which is kind of cool. 
Oh, there she is. First, let's rest. It's bedtime. Huh. I want to see how much experience I'm going to get from this. I want to actually gain that experience up. Four, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-five. Okay, not bad. Saving game. That chime never gets old. All right, let's talk to Sydney. Good morning, indeed. Uh oh, hi there. I was not expecting that. Hey, y'all about ready to settle up? Ready as we'll ever be. Didn't mean to keep you waiting. Oh, don't you worry about that one bit now. We have what was in the estimate. Yep, that ought to cover it. So, reckon it's about time we got you back together with your girl. <laughs> All right. Let's get in and get out of there. she is come see for yourself she's primed prim and proper I reckon you won't find a loose nut or bolt on her we're in your debt I'll say you are I souped her up a bunch for you I should charge you but I'm not gonna this one's on the house that's uh, awfully nice of you well just make sure y'all come back to hammerhead now you hear count on it Nowhere else we'd take it. Don't you forget it. <laughs> <laughs> Hop in. Right. Yo, oh, it's alive! Just let us know if you need anything. Well, it won't be about repairs next time. Well, that's fine by me. We can tune her up however you like in the garage. All you gotta do is just bring her on in. So it's all right if we call you? Sure is. Pop would love having someone to talk to. <laughs> we'll bring something by when we visit. For Sid, of course. <laughs> aha! Aha! Ha, ha. Time to hit the road. Her boobs are so <laughs> real. <laughs> it's actually kind of a fun little comment. Okay, so there is a Sid. There is a Sid. It is confirmed there's a Sid. Sid, Cindy and Sid. Yeah, got a Sid, okay. So, this is pretty much the ending of the Final Fantasy uh, 15 demo. AKA Final Fantasy Versus 13. A hint of things to come. Japanese audio only. Okay, let's see what they have. Laid waste by the Imperial Army. <clears throat> the enemy broke out of the sighting last night. The wall fell. The crown city followed. It rained fire around the citadel. Hold on. Announced that the term of the ceasefire had been suspended in light of these events. <clears throat> in addition to the passing of King Regis, we've now learned that Prince Noctis and Tenebrae's Luna Freya Fox Flore has also been found dead. But we're not dead. Take heed. Never bow for we begin. As long as you carry the royal blood, as long as you carry my name, carry the head high. Okay, cool. Thank you for playing. More to come in Final Fantasy 15. So, 
How do I feel? Overall, this demo gives a really good taste of what there is, how big the world can be. Yes. How big the world can be and how difficult the fights can get, especially when you're surrounded. You actually have to think about it. So, um, overall, I'm very impressed with the game. And if I have to give a score of the demo... I would say I would give the demo about a 7 out of 10 because you, it, you can get lost, it's a little frustrating, and um, uh, there was a, some technical issues, the game started lagging a little bit. But other than that though, it was great, I love it. So thank you all for watching, this is your host Scotty Oka. If you enjoy my live streams, go on ahead and follow me here on Twitch.tv, where I will be live streaming Final Fantasy Type-0 tomorrow. I will be doing more of that game. If you want to check out my other Let's Plays, such as Tales, uh, Time and Eternity, or whatever JRPGs there are, go on ahead and check out my videos on YouTube.com slash Official. And if you like what you see, go ahead and subscribe. I also have a Twitter if you want to keep up to date with my videos or whatever, or whatever random tweet I may have, go ahead and follow me on Twitter at ScottOka1, and I now have a Facebook account for those who are interested, so go on ahead and go to Facebook.com slash ScottyOka. Thank you all for watching, this has been a pleasure playing the Final Fantasy XV episode disk, so until next time everyone, catch you later.